uh, Stone uh, just mailed me that he wants an MLM website on Blogger and he uh, sent me a model. So here's the model that we are going to work on. Now we are not going to replicate this website, but we will try to create our own. Okay. So what this website is basically is, uh, uh, you know, a landing page of an organization like uh, a groundbreaker. Okay. That's a real, real estate investing. Okay. So basically what we are going to make is uh, something like this and we will just update it soon. So uh, watch the video till the end. Okay. So without further go, let's get started. Uh, first of all, we are going to, uh, I will provide you the basic code uh, or ending code also like at the end. Also, I will provide the whole code and the basic code which I am starting with is I will also provide this code. So uh, both the codes you will find in the description. And this video is in English language because Tom, I don't think so. He know Hindi language exactly. So uh, yeah, let's get started with the editing part. So this is our basic blogger landing page. Now, uh, what you have to do is just create a basic blogger theme, uh, sorry, blogger, uh, you know, account and just make a, a new blog and just go on themes go on edit html and then you will find the link in the description just download this uh, code i will provide the notepad and just remove whole code uh, which uh, which is in the blogger and just paste the code you just copied okay so it will something look like this and then you, you just have to click on save and you are ready to go okay now uh, we are going to start the editing part so first of all uh, let me check what actually we are going to. So here is the thing. You can change the background image. Okay. Now, first I will uh, teach you how you can change your background image to your own background image. Okay. So first uh, I will right click and click on inspect. And then here you can see a background image URL, which is the actual URL. Okay. So let me just try uh, copy some of this code and just search in uh, let me close this and go on edit html and here is the background url okay uh, if i if i just you know open this url you will find the exact image which is used here like this okay now here is the thing you can change the image according to you. Okay. So in my case, I'm not going to change it, but I will teach you how you can. Okay. So there are lots of websites you can use like uh, Pixabay, Pixel, Pixel. Okay. Pixel is a website you can use or you can use Pixabay. Pixabay. They are, you know, they provide free stock images that you can use on your website is okay. So like if you want this, you can easily implement this. You just need to log in or uh, they are free to download. Okay. They, you don't require something like in pixels. It easy. <laughs> okay. So let me discover something and something like I don't know a pretty background and oh, there are lots of images and okay let let let, let me choose this okay I will just free download it here you can see the picture is downloaded I just have to go on my blogger okay then go to pages then click on new page and just upload the downloaded image and here you can do it you just have to click on insert image upload from computer and it will just load 
I don't know why it's taking so long. Okay. Let me try to just, you know, use the link. I will just copy this image and just by URL. There are some servers issue, I guess. No problem. Let me copy and paste this. Perfect. Now image is loaded. I will just go on, you know, HTML view and just click on the uh, actual source. And here's the source image. And let me just check it by opening in a new tab. This video is going to be long. I, I don't think you will watch it, but please do it. Now just copy the source URL and now we have to use it. Okay. How to change it? I'm just explaining. Just go in, add it HTML and we just have to change the background. So yeah. Here's the background URL and here's the first URL and here's the second URL, which I have to replace. So I will just remove this URL and replace with my URL. Now let's refresh and boom. So uh, we are ready to go with the thing. I know images, uh, something blur, but actually you can just upload it by downloading in 4k. But I am just teaching you how you can change your own, you know, image. Okay. But uh, last thing, if you don't want the actual image, you can actually use gradients. You know, gradients are some pattern colors, you know. So uh, let me tell you how gradients actually look like. Now, here is some gradients you can see here. Okay. So you can easily use this also. Okay. That's, that's also look great. So if you want this gradient, you just have to get CSS and you can just copy this gradient and just go on the blogger, just replace the backgrounds. Uh, here's the background image and, uh, just, uh, remove this part, paste the code, which you just copied, click on save and you are ready to go. Okay, so these are some thing that you can do with your blog. Now, it's completely up to you. <laughs> the color of the button also is green. So yeah, I will not waste the time how you can change it. I know you learned it. So you have to implement it. Okay, now next thing, how you can change these text. You just have to copy some text like professional. I just copied the professional and you just have to search for it. Control F by opening the search box. You have to paste the key uh, word you have to replace and just click on enter. Okay. It's, it's not working. Why? Let's try to search one page. Oh, okay. Let's try to search just page. Ha, huh, not working. So let me just find the code manually inside the body tag. I don't know. There's some problem, I guess. So where, 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 where? Let me find it here. See, in the line six, six or seven, doesn't matter. Now here you have to replace your words like here I can see the taking dreams into reality. I just copy this and just replicate it. And I will just make sure to change everything that I'm doing after, you know, uh, just providing you the actual template. Now, uh, just click on save and then uh, this will definitely going to work. And just click. 
okay so here is something you have changed now click uh now you, i have to change the download now to learn more so just learn more oh sorry download now and i'm just going to change the download now to learn more okay uh then uh, just uh click on save and uh, we are ready to go now here's the second part i want to change this thing so let me copy the keyword retina and try to find it and it doesn't working i don't know why but let me go down and it should be inside 60 something like 600 700 so here is the 644 responsive uh, retina okay so i want to make it it depends on your uh, thinking okay so if you are uh, running an organization and you are providing something so you know better that what you are actually providing okay so it totally depends on you you can Uh, also remove this section okay by just you know uh, this section you can completely remove this thing it's up to you if you want it or not but uh, yeah you can change these text text by uh, you know the uh, this thing is comes here so if i type you know uh, topic 1 so this will become topic 1 and the uh, other thing will become topic 2 and other thing will i can give the name topic 3 i know you understanding it so uh, and this chocolate bar cakes is the description just below it p tag you can just uh, remove it and uh, you know make it what you want now if you want to change these icons like desktop you don't want it you want uh, something like heart let's suppose so how you can do it you just have to open the new tab search for font awesome and click on the first website link uh, the font awesome should look like this and just you have to search for the icon you want so let's suppose i want an heart and here i get the heart so i will just click on it heart and you can see here you can see you can just need a f a dash heart so what you have to do is just change this f a dash desktop to heart simple now and just click on save it uh, the uh, you know this will become now heart see okay now uh let's let's go on uh, the third part now we want this to change okay so what i have uh now uh what we want is to um, you know replicate this thing okay so what i am going to do is copy the image address of this image and just search for smart and creative design smart here we go just write smart and it will give you the results now here is the source image of the image you are currently watching okay so uh let me just comment out the sections for you you know i will just copy this section after the horizontal rule there is section 2 and after the horizontal rule there is section 3 there you go now what i want is this image so let me just copy this image and replace the url of this image to here and click on save and just wait and now watch it the image is loaded uh, you know like that now if you want to create your own image 
यू कैन जस्ट यूज कैनवा और एनी अदर टूल यू वॉन्ट ओके नाउ वी वॉन्ट द डाउनलोड नाउ टू बी लर्न मो सो आई विल जस्ट क्लिक ऑन कंट्रोल ऐप एंड यू नो डाउनलोड and i will just see the download now options okay now uh, i will just replace it with learn more because here i can just see the learn more buttons you can just give a uh, any name you can just type find out more but i am just writing learn more okay and i will just copy it and replace it with the uh, next two buttons which is Uh, and here you can see two more sections so i will just change it learn more okay, perfect and let me just click on save okay perfect now basically the text you are watching here you just have to search for it like i if i search for much more like here you can see the much more text okay and if i refresh this first for it should be learn more now here how it's working i i can explain now in the section 1 which is the blue part okay here you can see a light blue color which is a tag that i created okay uh, i mean css class okay which changes this colors okay so i can explain explain it more so first of all let me tell you this is section 1 you can just change the uh, you know headings like this smart creative to your sections you, what you want to provide okay suppose it's topic 1 uh, in my case and uh, some the text okay you can just implement anything you want this should be heading this should be the thing and uh, this will take you to the page now how to create page we will come to this later first of all let me just change the topics so this is topic 1 and here just topic 2 One, two. It should be two. And here, topic three. Now, just click on save. And ah, uh, now let me tell you. <laughs> let me tell you how you can change these colors also. Okay, light. I choose the light blue colors and light pink color. And here is the same. I can just change it. so let me tell you uh, any color you want first you have to search control f and then write light dash pink okay search this in your theme you will find two codes okay first is light blue color code and second is light pink okay uh, the word should be same okay doesn't matter now i want to add another color like i don't want uh, this color i just need another color so let me change it to something like greenish uh, this should be not for this works perfectly fine so i need this code so what you have to do is just create dot light dash green and the parenthesis and you have to write background colon and the code which we just copied from here okay now what you have to do is just copy this light green search for much more and uh, in the third section you know the third section is light right here section 3 and it's light pink i will just replace it with light green and click on save now the final code uh, you will actually get it you know final code you will 
get going to get it okay so don't worry about it so what is the main actual thing is uh, you know uh, the color codes are probably changing you can see okay now the image size is quite bigger that's why you know it's uh, <laughs> taking much more space but don't worry when you image upload your own image it will just take the actual size okay it's loading dynamically so that's why it's right there now now i am going to upload some demo blog post if you want to remove this section i will tell you how you can remove it but first of all let me show you what actually happened when you made some post so i will just go on settings and just go on you know importing post and okay let me just click on i am not a robot and this should be in my blogger 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 templates demo content yeah and just wait that it will going to post okay probably done and let me refresh it refresh this also okay and refresh it's not working fine i guess not working fine okay but okay i guess some images are not loading properly or the image is not here let me check it so images are here but they are not loading inside here i guess oh there could be any problem okay so but you know um it's not loading images there there can be some problem going on maybe is there any more let me try to you know just remove the pictures okay but if i open the blog the image should load maybe there's some problem let me try let me try to you know just upload an image and any image should be there Okay, so there is some problem, I guess, with the, uh, you know, because image that I uploaded is showing. Okay, but the image, let me uh, just make it smaller and just change the width of this post. Actually, the image quality is down. I know because it's an JPEG image, not the. Uh, let me j just upload an high quality image. why they made this blurry why nope so now uh, another thing i don't want these many blog posts to show 
so first of all let me go on my blogger and go to the settings and just change the number of posts from say, 13 to 5 or 3 3 is more than enough and yeah just refresh it okay 3 is great and the images will be going to load when you will applying this don't worry if it's not in my okay now here's the next thing you can uh, edit this uh, if you have an uh, you know uh, logos or images you can just replace the source url which is uh, in the feature logo section so you just have to search for feature logo Just go on edit HTML and search for feature logo. Hit enter. And here is the feature logo section. Now you can uh, change the logos. Uh, let's suppose you have in connection with the Forbes, NDTV or anything, you know, you can just update their logos and just, you know, make your uh, uh, trust more towards the uh, people who are visiting to your websites so you or if you don't have anything you can just simply remove the section it will just uh, you know completely remove this section so don't worry about it it's completely up to you now uh, the ending part is here we are going to connect the pages okay like if a user click on learn more it should be redirected to what here we are showing okay so how you can actually you know achieve this you just have to go on pages not post you have to go on pages and create some pages okay so let's suppose my first page is topic one and learn more is just lauren map some text if you don't know what lauren Epsom is it's just a dummy text that uh, web designers generally use okay and just publish this page and what you have to do is just copy the uh, you know you can either view it and after viewing you can just copy the whole URL and uh, what you can do is just go on the uh, theme section again and just find the button which is topic one so what I will do, I will just go and edit HTML and search for topic one. Okay. And here I should see the button, which which say learn more. So topic one, wait, what? Okay. There's some problem, I guess. No. Let me just try it. Is there any problem? Yeah, it's it's saying learn more. And when I go there and search for topic one, it's, oh, okay, okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. I got it. It's, it's the above topic one. So here's the topic one, which we are going to edit. And here the href, you have to paste the page URL, click on save. Now what will actually happen? These will uh, redirect to this URL. Okay, fine. And click on save, you can just find it. Now, if I refresh and let me just go there and click on open new tab. Here you can see your page is coming up. Now I don't want these comment box. So what you have to do is just go on settings and then try to find comments. Here is the comments. So you have to just hide the comment and click on save. Now refresh. Here you can see the co uh, comment box is gone. Okay. Now. I don't want the also the popular post to uh, I just want to remove the popular post section. So what I will just do it is just go on the uh, layout section. And in the layout, I will just find the popular uh, post 
I will just you know uh, remove it I don't want it then there is follow on Facebook uh, I don't want it contact form don't need contact form because I will provide the email there's no blogger archive should be now let's and refresh here's the thing okay now they are actually copy now one more thing guys uh, let me tell you uh, if you can't cannot see you can if you like sorry if if i just zoom in okay you can just see this this has a yellow background okay now uh, when i switch to the dark mode the text has a yellow background okay uh, you guys uh, sometimes face this problem what you have to do is just copy the uh, anything you copy from the website first you have to paste in a notepad or generally what i use is striphtml.com and just paste the text strip the html then copy the text and paste wherever you want okay now i i let me show you the difference okay Now I updated the post. Now you can see the difference. The yellow, white background has just gone. So uh, this is a method that you should always use whenever you are going to copy something. Okay. Now uh, let's go to the home page, and yeah, we are pretty much, you know, uh, done very much thing, very much uh, good things. Now uh, first we should, uh, you know change the copyright text so what we are going to do is just go on the blogger template again i know this video is now how much over 42 minutes i guess but what you have to do is stick to the plan and just watch the content okay now uh, we have to search for copyrights and in the copyrights again here is the copyright section here is the blog title and designed by this now uh, designed by let me remove designed by let me remove href link and let me remove not the whole thing let me remove the template this thing distributed by we will do follow by the templates now this much okay and make this a as an i and here also and click on save we cannot remove the id equals to my content because your theme will actually redirect to their server okay it will just uh, be like this okay so uh, there is a way to remove it you have to watch my other video okay so what we are going to change is the numbers everything so just copy these numbers okay you just have to copy the number and search it here and just you know paste the mobile number here and okay then change the email just below it change the twitter account handle you have you can if you don't have you can just simply remove it doesn't matter huh pretty much done our blog looks uh, website really looks good and so what i want is uh, some you know you can just create pages these are some pages and links okay what you have to do is just search for these things like if i search for 404 but i don't want the 404 page actually okay so here's the 404 page okay so what you have to do is you create your own page like if i uh, go with this uh, hey, how's the club works 
okay so you can actually just uh, replicate the same things just uh, you know let me copy this and not the uh, whole not the uh, how the club works i will just say it introduction okay and i will just i can create post or i can create a you know page they both are nearly same for this kind of websites it doesn't matter a lot okay so i will just create a page a uh, introduction and what what i will do is just copy the whole text and paste it just publish it and just copy the link i will again go to go to themes and this, then again go to edit html search for introduction and just replace the href with the actual page i created now you have to do is uh, the again for these two pages also which is here archive and blog you can just change the names and links and just click on save okay now some other things we can do is let me check what we can do more first so i want the logo should be much more bigger because it's it's small in size i don't like it so what i'm going to do is just change the font size to 2 rem yeah it should work so what i will search for is header h1a so uh, this thing i have to search for in the theme so you can exactly copy uh, what i am searching for header h1a space like here you can see it okay and you know, just change the font size from 20 pixel to 2 rem okay and just click on save now our you know you can increase increase this uh, you know definitely 2 rem it's it's now perfect now any other thing no i guess it is also working uh, no okay okay i haven't added the link here so uh, let me just copy the page that i used in introduction and you know just search for learn more and just replace the href with the introduction page now you can create another page not in the introduction page i am just for demo purpose i am just using the same urls okay now if i click on learn more it will redirect me to the introduction page okay so pretty much i guess we are done with this you just have to add more pages and just connect the learn more buttons like if you search for topic 2 you will find the learn more button and like uh, let me show you if you search for topic 2 okay it's not working so let me search for topic 2 okay another time here you can see the button href you just have to create another page and if you want to uh, you know change these images like if you want this image to be changed you just you can just upload an image to blogger uh, let me show you how you can do this so what i will do is uh, let me i have to close that just go on pages and don't you know just you can use the same uh, untitled post i will just upload an image let me show you how you can so uh, just you know is there any image let me search for it. 
now here's the earth image uh, what i can do is i can just copy the src url here and control c copy then i will just go on themes and add it as html then uh, of course topic 2 and another time and just replace the image url with the url okay and click on save now you can see the image is actually changed okay so this this is how you can actually edit the whole thing uh, in your web page now these images are also going to work you just have to uh, stay patient and start working on okay and here is the about page and contact page you just have to search for like if i search for site links in the blog there's some problem going on why it's not searching okay whenever i type in small letters it just search and when i type in caps lock it's not working there's some problem i guess okay there is a footer section uh, for this uh, i guess yeah so you don't have to worry you have to go on layouts and just scroll down and you will get the about about you can uh, write it here about yourself and the site link you don't need it actually you can just remove it doesn't matter okay now let me refresh okay probably yeah so this is the final thing that i came up with okay you just have to create more pages and just link it up okay and if you want you can uh, if like let me show you how you can so what is the basic problem is uh, as you can see uh, i tried to find uh, many times i didn't get any positive results but the main problem is uh, the blogger is actually adding the last four code as you can see there okay equals to and some then code so uh, this creates a problem okay if i remove the last four code from equals to it will actually work fine okay so yahi pura dikkat de raha agar isko mitata hu to dekhiye image ekdam perfectly load hoti hai so kya bolu ab main iska kya solution kar sakte hain yaar kisi ko iska solution mil raha hai to batana but mere ko to nahi mil raha kyunki maine isko try kiya s2 c ko use karke एस सेवन टू डैश सी देख सकते हैं यहाँ पर हमने इसको रिप्लेस किया हुआ है बट स्टिल ये वर्क नहीं कर रहा है किसी कारणवर्ष हाँ कोई नहीं इसको किसी को पता चलेगा तो वो डिस्क्रिप्शन में कमेंट में बता सकता है इसको कैसे ठीक करना है या मेरे को भी मिलेगा तो मैं इसको बाद में देख के ठीक कर दूंगा फिलहाल फिलहाल तो थक चुका हूँ वीडियो बनाते बनाते तो फाइनली मैं कह सकता हूँ कि ये तैयार है ठीक है तो होप करता हूँ आपने ये सब समझ लिया होगा इसको कैसे बनाना है ठीक है और ये कलर्स को भी आप अपने हिसाब से चेंज कर सकते हैं डेफिनेटली ठीक है तो मेरे ख्याल से यही थी वेबसाइट जो आपको बनाने की कोशिश कर रहे थे आप ठीक है आप ये इमेज आपको ये भी बता दें कैसे लगाना है तो परफेक्ट है आ, मिलते हैं अगले वीडियो के साथ होप करता हूँ आप 